The point of this video is that with a little more planning, uh, the plumber could have made his job a little easier and the framer's job a little easier. Um, all the plumber would have needed to do was to put the copper pipes, the water supply lines for the shower valve in the same stud bay as the shower valve. Now you're probably looking at the shower valve thinking, gosh, that stud could have went over to the left a little further, but, but it really can't. If you look at the bottom, it's already up against the um, copper pipe there. So again, if these pipes would have been located correctly in the right spot, the framer could have moved the stud over and gave the plumber plenty of room to put the shower valve in. Okay, I went ahead and drew in an imaginary water line. And just to give you an idea where the water line should have been. Now this would, the blue line represents the cold water supply line to the shower valve. So in order for this thing to be built correctly, um, you should have had two water supply lines in the same stud bay, in between the two studs in the wall, where the shower valve is. So again, is it a big deal? Yeah, um, not really. The plumber um, just created some more work for themselves and I couldn't properly locate the stud in the wall. Would have been nice to have moved that over a little bit. But uh, is it a big deal? Like I said earlier, you know, this is just poor planning. That's it. Um, you're going to spend a little more time planning the job planning out where all of the plumbing pipes, all the framing members, electrical, all of that stuff. You spend the time before you build it. You make the plans, you look. As you're building, if you see a problem and you can correct it, do it. But the time you spend um, going over the plans and looking for any potential problems, I guarantee you that's going to be time saved later on during the construction process.